On September 27, the Aerospace Division of the Islamic Revolution Guards Corps IRGC, successfully put the indigenous satellite Nauer 3, Light 3, also known as Najm, into low Earth orbit, LEO, marking another giant leap for the country's space program. The newest military satellite was launched by the CAST Messenger multi-stage rocket that traveled at a speed of 7.6 km per second in its final stage, placing it at an apogee max altitude of 462 km after 500 seconds. I congratulate all Iranian people, those active in the country's space industry, and the IRGC's space experts for this success," Iran's Minister of Communications and Information Technology Issa Zarapur said after the launch. God willing, this year will be a fruitful year for the country's space industry," he hastened to add, referring to earlier announcements in August that Iran would launch at least two satellites this Iranian calendar year. Iran's President Ebrahim Raisi hailed the successful launch of the Nauer 3 satellite into orbit as both a national success and proof of the failure of the enemy's sanctions and threats, congratulating the Iranian nation and IRGC space experts. It once again proved that the enemy's sanctions and threats have no impact on the determination of Iranian experts and scientists to tread the path of progress, he said. Iran's Foreign Minister Hossein Amir Abdelahian also commended the successful launch of the Nauer 3 satellite, which he said was the outcome of round-the-clock efforts of the country's young scientific experts. This honorable project is the result of the study and round-the-clock efforts of our country's young scientists and experts in the space industry and those within Iran's Islamic Revolution Guards Corps, he said. What were the earlier Iranian satellites? Iran has been launching satellites into space for the past 15 years, and Nauer 3 is the eighth Iranian satellite successfully launched by indigenous launch vehicles, as well as the third military satellite launched by the IRGC Aerospace Division. The first successful launch took place in August 2008, which was actually a mock-up satellite, with the purpose of testing the capabilities of the Safar-1 launch vehicle. With this success, Iran became a member of the elite club of only nine countries in the world that independently launched an object into space. In February 2009, the same rocket launched the first operational satellite named Ahmed, Hope, a cubic data processing satellite for research and telecommunications, which remained in orbit for three months. In June 2011, the second operational satellite Rasid-1, Observation, was launched. It was followed in February 2012 by the third satellite Navid, Good News, and in February 2015, by the fourth satellite Fajr, Dawn. The mission of all these satellites in the LEO lasted several weeks. All of the aforementioned satellites were launched by the Iranian Space Agency, ISA, aboard the Safar-1 liquid-fueled carrier rocket from the Imam Khomeini Space Center in Semnan Province. Since 2016, this Cosmodrome has been testing launches with the new, much larger Simard carrier rocket, which has four times more thrust and five times more payload than Safar-1. The solid-fueled carrier rocket Zuljana was also tested for the first time in February 2021. It has similar capabilities to the Simard, but is relatively smaller in size. In parallel with the civilian ISA, the IRGC is developing its own space program, and the purpose is military observation and telecommunications.
The IRGC uses the Shard rocket site for its launches, which is also in Semnan province, and the previous satellites Nauer 1 and Nauer 2 were sent by solid-fueled cased rockets. Nauer 1 was launched in April 2020, followed by Nauer 2 in March 2022, which is still operational today. The lifetime of the former was two years, much longer than earlier Iranian satellites. In addition to satellites launched with domestic technology, Iranian satellites were launched twice by Russian rockets from the Baikonur Cosmodrome. Sina in 2005 and Kayyum in 2022, both still operational. What is the purpose of the Nauer 3 satellite? According to the commander of the IRGC, Major General Hossein Salami, the newly launched Nauer 3 satellite is meant for intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance purposes. We use the collection of what we receive from the satellite and the information it gathers from the Earth to meet the IRGC's intelligence demands, he said after the launch. Elaborating on the specifications of the Nauer 3, Major General Salami said the satellite is 7 kilograms heavier than its previous version Nauer 2 and features imaging equipment that is more precise and produces pictures with better quality. Brigadier General Ali Jafarabadi, space commander of the IRGC Aerospace Force, also revealed that the mission of the Nauer 3 satellite is measurement and reconnaissance. 